Question number 53, A4 is given as 28, whereas A4 is P alpha raised to the power 4 plus Q beta raised to the power 4. We know that alpha beta are the roots of this equation, therefore alpha square is alpha plus 1 and alpha power 4 will be square of alpha plus 1. Its square will be alpha square plus 2 alpha plus 1 and alpha square can be written as alpha plus 1. So, this will become 3 alpha plus 2. Similarly, for beta, we will replace it here is p times 3 alpha plus 2 plus q times 3 beta plus 2. Now, we know that a4 is given as 28. So, we will solve this equation. It is 3 alpha plus 2 multiplied by p plus q multiplied by 3 beta. Beta is 1 minus alpha is alpha plus beta is 1. So, 3 minus 3 alpha plus 2 is equals to 28. We will collect the terms of alpha. Alpha, 3 alpha we will take common gives us p minus q plus then 2 p plus 5 q equals to 28. As we know that alpha is an irrational number because the quadratic have a discriminant which is not perfect to square. Therefore, this implies p minus q must be 0 as well as this quantity is equals to 28. p minus q is 0 and 2 p plus 5 q equals to 28. q equals to p placed here gives us p equals to q equals to 7 and they are asking us p plus 2 q. So, p plus 2 q equals to no this is not 7 this is 4. So, p plus 2 q is 12. So, the correct choice will be C. Answer is C. Question number 54, alpha raised to the power, we will develop a relation in alpha raised to the power n, alpha raised to the power n minus 1 and alpha raised to the power n minus 2 using this relation. I will multiply alpha raised to the power n minus 2 in it. This gives us alpha power n equals to alpha raised to the power n minus 1, alpha raised to the power n minus 2. Similarly, for beta, so a n, they have given us a n as p times alpha raised to the power n plus q times beta raised to the power n. So, alpha power n can be written as alpha raised to the power n minus 1 plus alpha raised to the power n minus 2 and we know the similar relation will hold for beta. So, it is beta raised to the power n minus 1 plus beta raised to the power n minus 2. Let us split it. We will club these two terms that gives us a, a n minus 1. I hope you will understand it. Then p alpha raised to the power n minus 2 plus q beta raised to the power n minus 2 will be a n minus 2. So, this is a recursive relation and they are asking us a 12. A12 gives us A11 plus A10. Therefore, C is the correct option. Answer is C. Question number 55. 